Hello humans and otherwise, I am Adesia and welcome back to my blind let's play of The Legend of Zelda Tears of the Kingdom. We have been following the arms of all these statues here and they have led us to, well, right here. Let's go see what we've got. This is a big area so there might be something to fight here, kind of looks like it. But the Yiga clan likes to be on here so... Who knows what we'll find? Did uh do what did do some weapon fusion? See, they're gonna want me to build. A yeah, they want me to build a vehicle here of some sort. I didn't think we'd see anybody else down here. I didn't expect you. Though I imagine you could see the scene to us, huh? Yeah. Uh, you're here to investigate too, right? You know, since you took the yeet, or I mean, the survey team interview. Because <laughs> we definitely took that interview too. That's why we're here. Yep. Eagle Clan, hello. Uh, uh, take a look at this. Our latest discovery nearly knocked us off our feet. We found this weird device with these wavering green letters on it and the strange statue. We think it's one of those living stone constructs. Pretty sure it's supposed to move too. Well, I see that, but it's all a gush conjecture on my part. Truth is, we're in a bit of a panic here. If we don't figure out how this thing works soon, we're going to be in big trouble. Yeah, but you're Yiga! You already admitted that you're the Yiga clan, so... Screw you. Um... Hey! Oh, you're not gonna let me? Ha! Huh. It's a warp point, too. Authorize your verified. It's moving! Conferring auto build to authorize her now. Please utilize it as you explore and excavate the depths for Zoanite. Auto build. Now this is the missing ability, huh? Ah, instantly recreate your Ultra Hand projects using nearby items in Zoanite. Auto build records your previous creations. Did I see what I thought I saw? The thing just give you the power we've been researching? That's incredible. C could you give us a demonstration? Let me see what the text has to say. Hold on. Um, this ability will allow you to commit any structure you create to memory. Any object committed to memory can be instantly reproduced. Ah. I noticed what to use it on. I was lucky I'd have it both of our vehicles just broke. We've been struggling to put them back together again. Oh. One of the round pedestal lost a wheel. Ah. One of the square pedestal has fallen to pieces. I think if you put the wheel back on the first one, you should be able to use your power to repair the second one in no time flat. <laughs> Come on, let's see it in action. Fix them up quick. You can start by repairing one of the round pedestals. Yeah, I see it. There are no registered designs. <laughs> wow, look at that. That goes right back on there. Snug as a bug. Now it's time for the main event. The one pieces of the square pedestal. Use that new power of yours and fix it up. Look at you split. Things that you make are stored in the auto build's history. So does anything? Yeah. But it does consume zoanite. To automatically do it. Okay, so I'm gonna need more. Wow, it's like I'm seeing double. Built in less than no time flat too. This is exactly what I was hoping for. Thank you, ancient power. 
The techs were right after all. I'll say, the power is incredible. Oh, master! Well, look at that. The legends were true. Koga, you did survive! Great work, both of you! You too, stranger. Credit where credit is due. Stranger? Yes, credit where credit is... There's one foul I'll never forget. It's a man who cast me from my Gerudo Desert hideout into these very depths! It was you! Now I live for vengeance, both upon that no good Zelda and upon my sworn enemy! That means you, Link! At least you didn't forget. We made to get at last! So this is, you just ended up in the depths and survived somehow. Don't try to tell me you've forgotten me. We are bound by fate, you and I. Hear my name in trouble and fear. I am the leader of the Yiga clan. The strong, the depths defying, from the ashes rising. Master Koga! Master Koga, leader of the Yiga clan. I saw it all. I saw the moment you obtained the ancient power we've sought for so long. The highlight of all those musty old tusks we found on this island, on this land. It remembers the objects you've assembled and can instantly reproduce them. A long lost ability from the distant past. So you, you, you're cheating! Here we are, working ourselves to the bone to build things by hand. And you can just whip them up in an instant. That's not fair! <laughs> you know who can use the power? The one we worship and revere. The Magnificent One! If you offered it to him, he would have crushed you and Zelda both. You just walked right up and snatched it away. You're an ineffective villain in Breath of the Wild. You're going to be ineffective here. Now I'm going to snatch it back. <laughs> Prepare yourself. Oh, you got lights. Okay, so we're fighting Koga. Oh, I can't deactivate it. Figures. I was on it for a moment. Hey! You're being just as ineffective as you always are, Koga. You're useless, you know that? I know some of my health, I, I can't restore it all right now. Plenty of apples. Oh, you put rockets in the thing now. <laughs> oh, but you just ran the wall with it and stunned yourself. No, don't crawl, Link. Hey. <laughs> Getting run over isn't the best option, you know? Okay, the rockets. Come on! Ah! 
Bang! Well, there goes that weapon. This one's about to break anyway. Let's break it. Okay, that takes care of that one. Ah! One hit away, of course. He goes and breaks it then. I mean, he, he teleports away on me. Ow. <laughs> yeah, it was never a seriously tough fight. This was a joke fight, if anything. Yeah, you pesky little pest. Why would you stand still? Let me squish you. Well, fine. I suppose I can let you off easy for today. You think you're so smart? But I've already found a whole bunch of ruins down here. Mm. I'll show you a little trick there. Use your right hand to get that construct going. I'll grab that power you cheated me out of myself at the southwestern abandoned mine. <laughs> then the magnificent one and I will guide this world to its miserable end, and there's nothing you can do to stop us. Oh, I'm gonna follow you, all right. Not quite in the same way that you just took off, but... Oh, well, okay. Well, that takes care of that problem. Excuse me. Thank you for repelling the trespassers. I hope you'll pardon me for listening in on your conversation. That man mentioned an abandoned mine in the southwest. I suspect that he was referring to the former Gerudo mine. That place flourished with activity long ago like this one, or was constantly unearthed and refined. There are statues that point the way to the abandoned Gerudo mine. Follow them to reach that destination. Oh, more statues to follow? I recommend you begin by making your way to the light you see over there. That was the plan. One more thing before you set out on your journey. There is something I would like you to have. Please speak with my associate with... Okay. Thank you for driving up the trespassers. I will, I will no longer need to hide in order to avoid detection. There's another reason it is good that you have come. I see that you have the ability to auto-build. That means the schema stone I carry is for you. Oh. Oh, so now I can just build one. You should now be able to auto-build an additional design. Please wait or prepare the necessary parts for you to test the stone. Well, this is nice. Schema stones can help you build things you never before imagined. Hope that you find this one useful. I need crystallized charges. I need large crystallized charges. I'm grateful to you for driving out the trespassers. It was necessary that I flee to avoid detection. Let us speak no more of that. How many do you require? I don't have enough zoanite. Uh, I need like large zoanite for those. Okay, I see. All of them. Definitely need to collect more zoanite now. That's fine, but it's for you. Auto build. Definitely have the ability to uh, make my uh, battery bigger now. It's gonna go actually, you know, do it.
I didn't expect to be more statues to follow. I can't see it right there, though. Okay, so... Pose. And since you've got a warp point here now... Pretty sure it was this one. We're going to go get this upgraded now. Wanted to do this before, but didn't have enough. Do now. Yes. Oh, so close to the second one. Yes. I thought it would be a full battery thing, but nope, it's only one. Well, still, it's longer. It is a bigger battery, nonetheless, and that's what we need. This is a different looking statue. Definitely do need to cook some more food. I haven't bothered to do that yet. Yeah, just go in the direction of the sword. Try to avoid that stuff over there. Yeah. Why does it have to be so darn dark down here? I don't like it. There are plenty of ways to make it light, sure, but... tell where anything is down here. Yeah. At least we got a tree.
I don't know where the statues are, though. Well, we're on the Gerudo area, and that's our destination, so that works out. Okay, there's a statue right now. I guess it wants us to go up. Considering, you know... Zonai devices? Yes, I'd say these are Zonai devices. So wait, where'd the torch go? Sure, I grab the one. No, no. Oh yeah, there's no wood here. <laughs> So just using the torch. Yep, definitely do need to come all the way up here. What's that? It's just a fire keys. Let me tell what's what down here. Behold the power of the Poe. Continue to go up, basically. Oh, this might lead to just, you know, a ceiling. No, nope. does that ceiling lead somewhere? All right, straight ahead. I know what we're looking for here. Besides, you know, Koga, obviously. Oh, oh, bonfires. There's a lot of those. I always need to collect more. I gotta go try that Phantom Ganon fight again. Except properly use my shield, parries, and all that. Because that'd be the way to handle it. That's how I should be doing it. I just haven't been doing it. I'm in too much trouble with the darn controls. Labyrinth. Means there's gonna be a shrine somewhere in the labyrinth. That's how it was before.
And I imagine just figuring out how to get into Labyrinth in the first place. Might have to just climb into it. But it's marked, so I come back later. Go right now is the statues. You ever see some of those stupid mobile ads where you can't even figure out what they're advertising? A lot of them I see is like a, a still picture and it's not even showing anything really. Like, what are you even trying to advertise in the first place? I don't even know what it is. Or when the advertisement is so bad, it makes you uh, not want to even look at their product in the first place. There seems to be most of the advertisements. <laughs> Alright, Keys, come on. <laughs> Fire Keys, eyeballs. Trying to throw one of the statue and missed. Stupid crap like, uh, I should pay for lunch because I have this much power in this particular, uh, mobile game. No, I should do it because I have more power than you do. Or they're on a date with someone. They're on a blind date. And they're like, oh, you don't, you don't have, you have very little power in this particular mobile game? I don't want anything to do with you. As if every single person plays that game. And the only thing that matters in life is how much your power rating is in that game. Not, not only are those ads incredibly stupid, it makes me not want to get anywhere near their products. Or when they intentionally play really, really badly. That's a common one. Just try to get people to get mad at the ad and then do it themselves. Yeah, okay, it is straight ahead toward the tree. That kind of crap doesn't work on me either. I just ignore it. Dragons down here? Well, I didn't expect that. I think I find them in the depths. It's a lot easier to get scales from them down here. Gloom got you. Yeah, the gloom will do that. Okay, that's a light.
<laughs> Let go now. I didn't know what that was. Might as well use your vehicle. Until that happens. Okay, then... That way... And having this extra battery will help. And hopefully we don't encounter any gloom hands on the way. Charges, we're just gonna drag it with us. Uh oh. It's one of them. The frocks. <laughs> Press the going the correct way. Yes, but that is a drop. So it was probably some zoanite too. Up there. No. Stuck. They're all heading this way. Haha. Uh -huh. Thanks for running over. Well, not where I was trying to go, but hills do that, you know? It's kind of their thing.
Go away! Let's go make some light. Okay, so, yeah, statues, they're going this way. This is a long path. Fine with me, though. We're going to go all the way. Find out where these statues all lead. I see you over there, statue. Thanks to that light that's in that direction. Yeah. Yeah. What if there's gonna be a bunch of different Master Koga fights? Yeah. Seems like it, considering he ran away, you know, I've got to chase him down. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, big pose. Grand pose, as they're called. Or the big pose from Ocarina of Time. There goes, what, ten of them you needed to gather up to get the last bottle? I did do that. It just took a while for me to do it. I only bothered to do it once, too, I think. I'm not sure I've done it the second time. Hey, there's Kogar right there, too. I was going to attack him right away. It's the right hand, right? So why isn't this working? You back there. Take over for a while. Huh? It's you again! So, Link, you just had to follow me here, didn't you? Of course I did. I'm doing what you did. Exactly. But it refuses to work. You don't have a Zonai arm. You tricked me. I won't stand for this. You wasted some of my time, but no more. I'll battle you. I'll beat you. And I'll steal that power back from you. Prepare yourself. Okay, so there is another Koga fight. I need some arrows, though. Yeah. Didn't know where he was at. I got some rockets here. Come on over here, Koga. Ah. Not what I wanted. 
wanted to do. It fired off too quickly. I don't have enough heroes for this. So this I can use. Boing. Ah, I missed. No fire. Ow. Good check of his health bar right there. Ow! There for bombs! <laughs> Do you, Koga? Oh, still bombs. <sighs> uh, arrows. One of the ones I fired earlier. Climate like. No! Is there where the spring go? Did he blow it up? Up, Link. I don't have time for you to struggle to climb it and you get shot as you're struggling to climb it. Go up.
No! Let's use the, uh, wind ability. Go up. Get up, Plank! You landed, and then you took forever to get up! Do it. Yeah. Ah, this place is too much sand. You're only winning because it keeps getting in my eyes. You got a mask on. I'm so so. I'm going to let you off easy again. That hunk of junk construct wasn't responding anyway. Change your plans. Operation Steal the Ancient Power is over. I quit. I hope that power make make things easier, but it's just icing. I'm after cake. We've been collecting a mighty power source scattered all over the all across this land. Crystallized charges. We're going to use them to restore an unstoppable weapon for the man himself, the magnificent one. What you do will grant his wish for the end of the world. We don't need the power you stole. Our collection of crystallized charges is well underway. The restoration of the final weapon is close at hand. You already stripped all the resources here. If you want this empty shell, you can have it. I'm going to be swimming in crystals at the Eastern Abandoned Mine. Well, thank you for telling me where you're going next. Me. Me. Now away I fly! <laughs> Greetings! Thank you for driving out the trespassers. I overheard your conversation. You spoke loudly enough that it was difficult not to. But Link didn't say a thing. The eastern abandoned mine that man spoke of is most likely the abandoned Lottery mine. It is extremely far from here. You will not find stone guideposts to it in this area. I suggest ascending to the surface first. You may be able to find a chasm leading there in a region to the east. There are two chasms. In the region to the, region to the east, that contains stone guide posts leading to the abandoned Lanarayo mine. They're called a chasm on land in the wetlands. There's also one south of there in a the mountain village. There's one other thing before you resume your journey. My associate over there manages a scheme of stones. You may want to ask for one. Okay, so I can't continue from here. Well, there we go. Let's get you going. Welcome, I'm a forge construct. I process zonite here and order other materials. I don't have enough zoanite anymore. Yep, I know. Okay, over 200 now.
And you for a new schema. Welcome. This is once a busy refinery where a great deal of zoonite was processed. My task here is to manage designs for making mining equipment. Please hold one moment. I have confirmed that there is a schema soon you do not yet have. Allow me to rectify that. Oh, hovercraft. I'm curious about one other thing. Do you know what Autobuild will do if you have insufficient parts? Tell me. Autobuild will not be able to manufacture an object if any of its component parts are missing. But Zoanite can help with this. You can supplement mis missing parts by using Zoanite to mimic their form and properties. Keep in mind they are temporary parts created by the Autobuild ability. You cannot use them for other purposes. They will vanish when you disassemble the creation they were intended for. <laughs> I assure you they are useful despite these limitations. I think you'll find your own purpose for them. Unfortunately, I do not have any zoanite now. But at least Koga was beaten again. Unfortunately, we don't have a warp point here either. That's a problem. But there is one right there that's not too far away, so I suppose it's not too big of a deal. Alright. Gonna go back to the surface. Gonna make some food. And, uh. See if that one quest is done now, too. Right here, because, yeah, report your discovery. But I'll meet you up there next time. So thank you for watching, and I will see you in the next video. If you enjoyed my video, please give it a like. And don't forget to subscribe so you don't miss any of my future videos. And if for whatever reason you want to talk to me, you can find me on Discord in a link in the description.